Capricorn, this is our soul, intuitive uh, tarot for unique souls. Welcome to my channel. Capricorn, this is going to be your weekly uh, general focus reading uh, for the week of March 7th through the 13th, 2016. All right, Capricorns, let's get right into your reading. The overall energy that I'm sensing for some of you, uh, and because this is a general reading, the messages that come forth will apply to some of you, but not all of you. And again, I cannot express that enough. Okay. Um, overall energy for some Capricorns uh, for this upcoming week, we have the Nine of Wands in the upright uh, position. Nine of Wands in the upright position is a physical card related to fire energy. Uh, so, excuse me, some of you may be dealing with uh, fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, male or female, and the messages related to battles and struggles. Personal interference could come from uh, relationships with fire signs uh, in terms of uh, romance and intimacy also relates to uh, friendships some of you may be dealing with um, battles and struggles with friends family members uh, co-workers so the energy that I feel that and also to keep in mind that this uh, nine of wands could represent uh, your own internal uh, battles and struggles and you trying to sort uh, your life out uh, depending on where you are currently um, at this moment. So it's a lot of battling and struggling. And then I also see personal um, interference. This Nine of Wands also shows up that it could relate to some Capricorns actually getting into physical fights. So again, since this is a general reading, it could apply to friends, uh, family uh, members, co-workers, um and relationships okay so it's battles and struggles for some capricorns uh with this upcoming week uh, personal or internal or external that's what i'm getting related to possibly fire signs some could be in a relationship with a fire sign and there's some sort of battles battles and struggling going on in terms of that relationship or the person that you're dating all right recent past uh capricorn we have a major arcana, major life event, the chariot in the reverse. So this is uh, an indication that something may have came to a complete stop or halt. Um, one I'm getting in terms of a relationship, maybe something um, in the recent past might have been someone that you met new and, you know, things were going well. And then all of a sudden it was a complete stop. Also, too, with the uh, chariot in the reverse, I'm getting uh, a message about uh, car trouble. Someone's had car troubles. <laughs> yeah, someone's had car troubles. And I'm sensing because, it's, you know, the chariot is in the reverse. It could have been like someone's battery died or something, something to do with the car. And then also, too, I feel that... Um, it's in the reversal. It's passing energy. So some of you may have purchased another car or there was some sort something going on with the car. OK, I'm definitely getting that <laughs> that message about something happening to a car. And if you were looking for a new car, uh, purchase a new car, maybe the loan didn't go through something to do with something comes to a stop. Something came to a complete halt uh, related to a car. And then also I'm getting. A message about um, a relationship coming to a complete stop or halt. It made it, like I said before, you may have met somebody recently and then, you know, communications were good and then all of a sudden, boom, it just stopped. Okay. I'm getting uh, water sign energies with this uh, chariot. So it could be uh, persons involving uh, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces, male or female. Just something coming to a stop or a complete halt. Uh, some of you may have received some sort of uh, traffic violations with this uh, chariot showing up in the reverse. And yeah, something going on with uh, traffic violations, something coming to a complete halt. Someone's battery died on them. And then the possibility of a relationship coming to a complete stop. Also, too, I get the emphasis of a car was purchased. 
with the a chariot or not necessarily a new car but another car maybe an additional car to uh add to the family some something to do with the car okay i don't want to spend too much time on that chariot i'm just getting a lot of messages here and i'm giving you the best that i can get as i'm getting it uh but for time's constraints i'm just going to go ahead and move on but something's going on related to a car and something coming to a complete stop in the middle of the week for some capricorns we have the theory of swords in the upright position okay this is all about heartache separation splits possible divorce uh love triangulations uh, the Three of Swords is never a good card to get in terms of a reading, especially a love reading. But some of you may be enduring this energy. If there isn't a split, then there is some sort of heartache related to a relationship. So I'm getting air sign energies with this Capricorn. So some of you may be dealing with uh, Gemini, Aquarius, um, Libra, male or female. Somebody is upset or heartbroken. Uh, related to a relationship and this is indicative of any Capricorns involving themselves or have themselves involved in a love triangulation it could be you that is um, feeling some sort of heartache or being heartbroken related to that situation I'm not judging jewelry um, when it comes to love triangulations whatever suits you uh, and works best for you uh, so be it. But I'm just picking up that some of you may endure some sort of a heartache, separation, split related to uh, a relationship. Somebody, somebody is creating some sort of conflict or anxiety. I see you. I see the Capricorn as the one being conflicted and dealing with some stress and anxiety related to a relationship. And then also outside of a relationship, because I'm getting this other, excuse me, other message, it's related to a split separation from something else. Um, so it could be a friendship. It could be a job separation. It could also be uh, related to someone having to be upset or heartbroken about leaving something something behind okay so i'm just going to leave that there it's a lot of energy with that three of swords uh, coming in the tail end of the week for uh some capricorns we have the magician major arcana major life event so uh we have two major arcanas in your reading so there's some uh intense energy coming up for some capricorns this week so the magician number one uh in a positive sense it's like the capricorns you have all the tools uh, necessary to manifest any um, you know goals that you want to achieve and of, of course you know take this message as I'm saying it to you and relate it to anything that's close or significant to you um, or important to you in your life that could be a relationship friendship a new job uh, something going on in the family also the flip side of this and the more negative tone of the magician for me as I read it it could be that some Capricorns are dealing with an individual that's um, coming across as being somewhat bipolar or having some sort of mental stuff going on uh, I am not a clinician I'm just an intuitive and the messages that come through I put out there to you the best that I can uh, someone is being very reckless and they don't care how their behavior affects the other person so and also too there's a message for uh, some Capricorns with the magician showing up to please be careful about any tricksters okay that's what the magician for me as I read it in a negative sense is all about someone playing tricks on you or being um, caught up in some sort of tricky situation so just be careful uh, Capricorns uh, but this individual is coming across as very <clears throat> selfless self-centered and somewhat ruthless so that's the negative the positive I've already given you and the energy oracle card that I have uh, selected for uh, Capricorns for this upcoming week is man holding a heart now this card here specifically because I read for males and females I'm just gonna say for females in particularly there is a new interest uh, this card always represents someone new coming into your life so it could be this week 
It could be this week that you meet somebody new for the ones who are single. Also, I feel that the ones who are coupled, this man is coming across as being very generous, very loving and supportive towards you. Um, so just keep that in mind too. This is twofold to this um, to this man holding a heart. There's someone for the singles to meet potentially this upcoming week or get closer to or be drawn closer to someone new uh, that comes across as being generous, loving, and caring. And then for the couples, the male or the female in your relationship is uh, caring, loving, and supportive of you. Wow, that's interesting. I like that. The man holding the heart. All right, so this is your reading, Capricorn, for the week of uh, March 7th through the 13th, 2016. Once again, I want to thank you for visiting my channel. And I do want to wish you all a very safe upcoming week ahead. Until the next time, I do wish you all love and light. Take care. Bye.